to thank everybody for coming. Uh, it truly is amazing, Carol and I, to have you all here. First, I'd like to share this day with another couple. That they chose this date to have their own wedding. 22 years ago, my son Ed and his wife Mary Beth, and they're celebrating 22 years today. You know, people said, How do you do it? How do you stay together 22 years? I'll give you two things. Number one is consideration. Before you say something, before you do something, consider your mate. If it's going to hurt that person, don't do it. All right, that's number one. Number two, and this is for all the men in here, there are two simple words that keep your life together. <laughs> Does anybody know what those two words are? Yes, dear. Yes, dear. <laughs> you remember those two words? Life is great. <laughs> and the other thing is that, you know, 50 years is not that great. I mean, if you were a graduate of St. Martin's in Amiens, <laughs> it's no big deal. Right. My brother Jim, graduate from St. Martin's in Amityville, he and his wife Marion, 54 years. Wow. Hey, all right. one, one couple that couldn't be here tonight is another graduate of St. Martin's, and that's um, <laughs> Jim, Jim, and Judy. Huh? Jim and Judy Fogan. Judy, unfortunately, got sick. Married 21 years, uh, 51 years. And my friend over here, Jack, and his lovely wife, Taiki, will be 50 years at the end of this month. And it rubs off. It rubs off. Our backyard neighbors, Barbara and Frank Kozak, that we've known for 30 years up in New York, and now they're still there in the same place. They're married 52. What? 51 years. So, it does rub off, you know, and uh, again, I, I, this is probably the finest thing that's ever happened to us. And I want to thank everybody, especially my children. And I'm going to introduce them all. <laughs> right? First, they're the eldest, our eldest son, Edward, and his wife, Mary Beth, and their two boys, Robert and Michael. Robert and his wife Teresa. <laughs> and his children, Christopher, Marie, and Adam. <laughs> and I got to introduce Christopher's girlfriend, uh, Amanda. <laughs> and then we have, thank God, my only daughter. <laughs> Give me this today. My mind is going, you know. and our youngest son over here, James, and his lovely wife, Anne Marie, uh, and their two children, Caroline and Leah. Thank you. 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 Thank you.